Hi guys and welcome back to my channel. Thank you so much for tuning in. So yesterday I asked you guys on Instagram whether you wanted to see me recreate my makeup look that I wore to the lifestyle event and a lot of you guys said yes. Here I am going to recreate that look and guys don't judge me that is the only makeup look that I know. So I'll be looking here because I have my mirror over here. Bear with me and let's begin. I have my skin all prepped for makeup. I've moisturized my skin, I've washed it and everything. Let me know if you guys want to see my skincare routine as well in the comments below. Okay, so to start off, I'm going to prime my skin first and I'm going to use the Color Bar Perfect Match Primer. This one is a silicone based primer and actually fills all of my pores and give me like a, gives me a very smooth texture. Okay, so now that I've used primer and I've filled all my pores and it's looking quite blurred out, I'm going to use my handy dandy you know i love this bb cream it's the la girl pro bb i do not require a lot of coverage touch wood bless the jeans i have good skin so yeah i only rely on bb creams using my pack 006 foundation blush brush Don't forget your ears. Drag it down your neck also. Don't forget to pull it into your hairline as well. Otherwise it's gonna look awkward. My BB cream is done. And now let's move to concealing. I'm going to use the LA Girl Pro Conceal in the shade Pure Beige. And also the Elegal Pro BB Cream is in the shade neutral by the way. Yes. So what I'm gonna be doing is I'm gonna make an X. You know the X shape. Two X's and an arc here. And just a line over here. And now I'm going to blend this in. Make sure you blend it in a U and drag it down. It's like tap, 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 tap U and drag it down. I think my concealer is also done. So now we got to set all of this. So I'm going to be using my powder, the Fit Me Matte and Poreless in number 230. Using the same brush and just dab it in, dust off the excess. You want to press your powder in so that it stays in place and looks quite matte. My base is complete. Now, let's move into doing my eyebrows. I'm going to be using this random eye groomer which looks like this. And you know I love my Wet n Wild Ultimate Brow Kit in Ash Brown. So first, I'm just gonna brush my eyebrow hair out. Now to create ombre brows, you got to use the lightest shade in the front half of your eyebrow and the dark color in the last half of your eyebrow. So that's what I'm going to be doing. Okay. 
okay so now i'm happy with my brows we'll move into eyeshadow and okay to start off i do not have any eyeshadow skill so it's just the basic this is how i do my eyeshadow so yeah let's begin oh and also a lot of you guys said that my audio was not that clear so i got a mic like you guys can see let me know if the audio is any better right now first of all i'm going to be using my bronzer and that is the makeup academy undress your skin bronzer which looks amazing just look at it the pan itself so i'm going to be taking some random 20 rupees brush dipping it in <laughs> my sister is laughing at me <laughs> okay dust off the excess and put this in your crease just to give your crease a little more depth and dimension so if you have hooded eyes like i do you got to make your own fake crease above your crease okay that's how you fake an eyelid because we don't have eyelids visible i don't know how that works but tati said it works so it works the next thing you want to do is take your blush the blush i'm going to be using today and is my current favorite is this uh, wet in wild color icon blush in wow in mellow wine which looks like this it's a super pretty color so i'm going to take it on the brush and just put it in my outer corner So now that I've put my blush in the outer corner, use my highlighter now. The highlighter I'm using is the Maybelline Master Chrome in molten gold. Looks gorgeous. And I'm going to take it the back of my finger and just put it in my inner corner like here, you know here. So by using your bronzer, blush and highlighter as eyeshadows, you don't have to buy any other products especially if you're a beginner like me. This trick totally works. I'm going to take my what is this called? Faces Magnet Eye Kajal and just line my eyes. So the last step before getting done with our eyes is of course mascara and the mascara I'm using today is the Maybelline Hyper Curl Volume Express mascara. This one is the washable one. It's not waterproof because waterproof mascaras are pretty hard to take off. Who else makes funny faces while applying mascara? I like my lashes very voluminous and clumpy. So, if you like that look, you will love this mascara. And I'm pretty sure you can get this mascara at less than three hundred rupees when Nykaa is having their sale. So that's how my eyes are looking. The next step is of course bronzing or contouring. I don't know what's the difference. So yeah, let's take my bronzer again. The so I'm going to dip my brush. I got this brush from uh, Shein. It was a brush set for 500 rupees. I got 12 brushes. and they're pretty good by the way so yeah i'm going to dip my this thing 
make a fish face. You know, the bronzer behind, so. Mm, look at that. I'm gonna contour my uh, jawline a little bit as well. Okay, now bronzing or contouring is also done. So let's move into blush and it's the same blush that I'm using again. It's the Wet n Wild Color Icon in Mellow Wine. It's a pretty, pretty color. Should totally check this out. I highly recommend this blush and it's really, really pigmented by the way. So, you want to smile? Look how pretty that looks. Now let's move into highlighting. So I don't go very crazy with my highlight. I just like to keep it natural and just in the places where the natural light hits. So I'm going to be taking the other brush from the 12 set collection I've got from Shein and dip my brush very light handed dust off the excess and can you see that because it's popping take a little bit on my finger and put it on the center of my nose oh damn shit okay guys my makeup is done pretty much right now and we're only left with one step that is lipstick so the lipstick i have used yesterday was huda beauty liquid lipstick in the shade heartbreaker it's an amazing amazing perfect red and of course Ruby Woo is a straight dupe for this one and the color bar hot 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 as well is a dupe for this one but I prefer wearing liquid lipsticks so I'm going to be going in with this one okay i think our makeup look is complete Okay, so that was it you guys for this video. Thank you so much for watching. If you have any video requests, please leave them in the comments down below and make sure to subscribe and give this video a thumbs up if you like this video and I'll see you in my next one. Bye.